Come back to this. Something that we'll be driving in our car one day and it'll come to us or whatever, you know? I feel like my spirit's being broken over the camel's hump today. Start recording the actual record and stop demoing. We've been here two months and we haven't actually laid anything down on the tape. I want to start laying stuff down on the tape. I'm ready, to, I'm ready to start recording. In about a week or so, our producer's gonna come on down to the studio. We'll start recording and we'll start recording these songs. Start recording these songs for you, for you, for you. Your mom to listen to. Jerry's here, and uh, our engineer's here, and we're getting ready to. There's Jerry. There's Jerry Finn. Jerry's kind of like a. It'd be like if you were putting something together when you were a child, and your dad or your mother's sitting over you going, okay, do this. They're kind of like telling you the steps if you get lost. And then you stop. And wait for the one, and then you start over on the hand again. Working with Jerry is like having the fourth member of Blink 182. He's a great producer in that he comes from a really strong musical background. He grew up playing in punk rock bands, and so he understands music and he understands how a song should be structured. Okay, I'm gonna record that. <laughs> It's okay. exactly a, a clear vision of, of where we wanted to take our music. The songs are a lot more diverse and there's a lot more emotion in the songs. songs in the can so far and I think they're great so I mean you know two great songs now all we gotta do is record a bunch of and throw together the rest of the album we're golden coming up next on album launch the people that we are running the house from they want their house back there's no way we're gonna move out of here they're, we're, they're just gonna have to kick us out <laughs> Time to go record the Blink record. <laughs> in a perfect world, we'll finish the record in three months, maybe four months. But this time we're building each song individually. You know, doing drums, guitar, bass, singing, adding more things, and then starting on the next song, and maybe going back to the first song later on, and trying all this different stuff out. So, who knows? It might take, it might take five years. Two, three, four, one. 
now uh, Travis is about to leave on tour of the transplants, so he works with us from noon to six every day. And then he goes to transplants rehearsal. See, me going on the transplants tour is going to put things behind a little bit. Well, hopefully we'll be done with all our songwriting. And it sucks, man. I'm leaving. There's nothing I can do about it, you know? I'm going, on, I'm going on tour. There's nothing I can do. What I plan on doing is like getting a bunch of drum beats, a bunch of you know parts, and then giving them like a big box of, of my creativity before I leave on that tour. It's gonna be fun. I'm so sleepy. I'm very sleepy. My kid gets up at 4:30 in the morning. I'm here at the studio till midnight. So I have to catch up on my sleep while Travis does his jump stuff.